Hello everyone, welcome to Gila Moon Tarot. This is your uh, weekly singles love reading for a Gemini. How are you guys? I hope you're well. See what's happening with you, single Geminis in your love life. I have a little positive affirmation. Notice how abundance flows into your life in delightful and surprising ways. Okay, it means things can change suddenly. It's about being open to the abundance and what you put out there comes back to you. <laughs> it's about being open, allowing it to flow. So, Gemini, let's see what's happening with you. New love prospects or connections for Gemini. Oh, there we go. All right, I feel we have someone here who is definitely <laughs> inspired to communicate up maybe even multiple opportunities someone's in a hurry here Gemini there we go oh that's too many Gemini there we go thank you little Pisces energy so it's about trusting your intuition here okay you probably know who this is it's possible little Pisces energy just trusting okay your inner self that you already know yeah also, sometimes I see just trusting your intuition and how someone communicates, how fast they move. Okay. Reading between the lines. Yeah. So I do see possible mul multiple opportunities. <laughs> yeah. Someone here might be keeping a secret. They may have other opportunities, but it's about being open to other opportunities. Okay. It's the energy of making a choice. Someone's making a choice here. So it's up to you to decide. Yeah. I see a energy of inspiration again five of wands so there may be competition so you may have someone comes in quickly out of the blue you may have multiple opportunities it's looking like it things are speeding up and it delays someone feels like they're in a hurry to make some kind of a decision okay it's about taking action it's about whether something is worth fighting for or what somebody wants <laughs> and we have temperance and then we have Okay, and we have the star. So it's an energy of just being patient here. Okay, tempering your passions and emotions. Feel like you got someone who's a little different than their usual type. Now, this could be someone here who just, you know, very spontaneous. I can see a little bit of Aquarius energy, see a little Pisces, and I see some Sag, someone spontaneous. Mm hmm. So. <laughs> I feel like you got a couple of things happening. I feel like you have to make a choice here. You might decide to just keep your options open. I feel there's some competition here. Yeah. Someone's looking for fun. That may be in it, that what you're a little bit worried about here. I don't really feel worry. I feel more like you're just sort of going to just let your intuition guide you. Yeah, it's how someone conducts themselves. It's about having faith. You know, it's about two people being on the same page communication I see a little bit of um, Taurus energy here so I feel like it's how someone conducts themselves now it could be to do with the communication see it has to do with building a foundation so there's something positive I feel like you're kind of looking at this but I feel this is someone who's about to make a decision I feel like it's this person being spontaneous coming in Okay, now it could be an invitation to a party, a celebration. This person may, it could be some kind of a secret here though. Yeah, read between the lines here. Yeah, I feel it's an energy of multiple opportunities. But you know, look at that energy of the Four of Wands. This is a, a celebration, a party, a house, a home. It has to do with a foundation. It has to do with commitment. Now we have someone here, I feel, who's in some kind of a hurry. Okay, maybe you have a choice. Okay, you may have someone here that you're just not on the same page with. You don't get. Because <clears throat> I see the lovers. A little Gemini. That's your energy. <laughs> so I feel like you've got a choice here. Yeah, a little procrastinating, having to make a decision. Mm -hmm. Look at that devil energy. Oh, someone's in a hurry. I feel like you got someone who's crazy about you here. But I do feel it's an energy of, you know, whether something is worth fighting for. Because the devil is often an energy of someone who's a little bit obsessed. They need to temper something here. This person's real. It almost feels like they're in a real hurry here. A uh, real panic to get things going. But your intuition is telling you something. Now, I don't know if this person's secretly married or in a relationship. We're going to find out. It certainly looks like someone's up to something here. 
Just, I feel like you'll make a decision. You're going to look at all the possibilities here. Now, I feel like you just have to make this choice whether someone's right for you or not here. But you have another person who's suddenly in a hurry to commit. They're, this is someone who's crazy about you, obsessed with you. They're taking action, fighting for what they want. Could be someone who's going to get angry if you ch choose another person. So really watch that energy. But look at this most, emo, uh, emotional fulfillment. Something here. See, tempering your passions and emotion. It's about what makes you happy. Pulling back. You may feel something is off. Something isn't right here. So it's about letting go of things that no longer serve. So I feel some of you are letting go. I feel like you have a person here who probably gets jealous if there's competition. Um, when you're about to make a choice choosing somebody else here someone is being i feel it's an obsessive and jealousy with the inspiration the obstacles challenges fighting um, but to me it looks like we, you have a person who doesn't like that there's competition see and i feel like it's an energy of somebody who all of a sudden decides they want to commit now i i feel here it has to do with your own happiness so just i feel it's saying to just pull back here and take a look at this just sort of take a little moment be patient with yourself and just pull back and look at this. This is what you want. Is this something that will make you happy? But I, I, I feel like you've got a person. See, there's an energy of three. So it's about finding someone compatible. I feel there's someone here you're just not compatible with. Okay, I don't think you're on the same page. Uh, and it's more than likely because you're keeping your options open. Someone here feels that you're keeping your option open or you have other options. It looks like jealousy. Uh, but I feel it's someone who just kind of comes in out of the blue. It's something to do with the way they conduct themselves. I feel like your intuition is telling you this person isn't faithful, okay? Or they feel like you're not. But whatever the situation, I, I, I feel it's time to partner up here and go look at the things you have in common, who's compatible with the choice. Yeah, tell me about this devil. I think there's someone here. Um, yeah, you got someone who's a little bit of a player. See, look at the facts. Uh, I feel like you will figure this out. Uh, someone here is either in another relationship or they're in a, suddenly in a hurry to commit. Okay, someone's being a little bit on the sneaky side here. Player energy. Yeah, just trust it. I feel like you're going to know. Yeah, it could be someone who's already in a relationship. But I also see energy as someone who suddenly wants to commit because they're jealous. They don't want you to choose another person. I feel like you're going to choose the person you're compatible with. You're going to go down this path. You're going to do what makes you happy because something feels off with this person. See, this has to do with seeing the bigger picture. You're figuring things out. You're looking at the facts. Yeah, someone's trying to sneak their way back in here. Yeah, and then they get jealous, you see. <laughs> this is someone who gets jealous here they're trying to figure out how to um, uh, rush towards a commitment with you but i'm not so sure they ever would but we're gonna see tell me about the seven of wands yeah this is someone who wants to be single someone's trying to figure out if you're single or if you're this is a jealous person who's uh, crazy about you but it's that energy of a little bit of a player okay obstacles challenges competition this person's trying to figure something out I feel you're going to, because I feel you're going to move off in another direction. This is a choice here. It's looking at all the possibilities, how something can play out. Okay, so it's an energy of looking at this. Someone's fantasizing about you. Probably trying to figure out if you're single. You look good, you take care of yourself, but I feel this is someone, a player, they just want to be single. That's just what I feel. You need to be careful. Or someone's in a relationship acting single when they're not. Um, you're going to pull back and feel something is off. Your intuition is going to tell you. Yeah, see, there's a, this person's involved with other people. But I feel like you're going to move on. I, I actually got to tell you, I feel as though you're just going to make that very wise choice. Uh, I feel there's some positive news going to come out of this. <laughs> yeah, you're meeting other people. They're jealous. See, you're open to other offers, other options. Oh, yeah, this person, yeah, see, this is someone who's a little immature. It's all about themselves. They're focused on themselves. Yeah. See, it's an energy of waiting. So, yeah, I feel it's too little too late with this person. You've already met someone else. They're going to lose it. They might even get angry, so a little heads up there. But I just think this person's kind of immature. It's kind of all about them. Uh, I think they just want to be single. They, You know, this is somebody here for a good time, not a long time. Uh, and I think you know this too. You've got it sorted out here. 
Um, it's just a little confirmation for a lot of you. But, I, you know, it's energy of just kind of waiting here. But I feel while you were waiting for someone here, you've sorted it out. You figured it out. The ship has sailed. You, you're off on another path. You've got someone here. It's energy where you're loving yourself first, but you're letting go of this person. You're no longer waiting. Okay, it's where you start looking elsewhere, meeting other people. They're not liking it. They're jealous. So... <laughs> there you are. So you want someone compatible. You know, I feel you're looking at the situation. You don't really see a future with this person. You're just doing you, doing your own thing while you were waiting. But I feel while you're waiting, you've sorted a lot of things out because of the situation, the details. You see, they may be compatible in some ways, but I feel it's an energy where you deserve better. Okay, uh, with the star, you deserve better. Uh, I feel like there's another person here who adores you. Uh, I feel as though you've got a choice. Yeah, yeah, you've got a king of wands. Ooh, it could be this person. you got a player energy. Hmm, what is happening? Are you going to... No, I see what's going on. This is somebody who's kind of leveling up here. But, uh, or you've got two people. One is younger than you. One is uh, more mature. But I feel there's someone here you don't see a future with. I feel you're looking for someone more compatible. I feel like you're just going to ground yourself. You're going to be sensible about this decision. I feel like you're going to look at the facts and figure it out. Yeah, you've got something new. Uh, I see a Leo energy. This other person here, I do see some Capricorn energy. And I feel this person's crazy about you if you got Capricorn or maybe Taurus or Virgo in your chart. Gemini, maybe a Gemini Taurus cusp, are you? Yeah, you got someone who you're just not on the same page with. I feel it's an energy of someone who's just not faithful. Uh, and I feel like you know, you know who this is, or you are just going to sort it out by trusting your intuition. So I see an energy here. See, it's an energy of someone coming back around. You know who this is, but I feel like you've changed. You see, you're moving on here. This is someone who's uh, coming to that realization you moved on. They're crazy about you. I feel like you're just focused on your money. You're just being grounded and sensible. I do see there you are manifesting. See, you're manifesting love. You've manifested a couple of people. So it looks like you got some options. Uh, but you're also focused on your money, mastering life. You have all the tools, the information, everything you need. Um, yeah, I think you have someone who's a bit of a manipulator here too. Um, focused on themselves here for a good time, not a long time. <laughs> Yeah, see, someone who rushes in and rushes out. <laughs> yeah, you got another. It looks like you got a new person, somebody else who's got some fire in their chart. It looks like someone new. Uh, this is somebody here, very high vibrational energy. Uh, this person's attracted to you. This person's a leader. They're coming in to take the lead. See, this is someone who's, they're going to run away. Uh, I, I feel this person's going to be gone. I don't think they're going to bother you, but I'll let you know there's some jealousy here. So someone who rushed in and out very quickly. So I, I feel as though you were waiting for this person. While you were waiting, you were focused on your finances. But see, what when, when you wait for somebody and you focus on other things, your own life, your house, your home, things like that, you have a tendency of sorting things out while you're working, you know. And that's where I feel you're getting out meeting new people. And you're going to meet someone new here. I feel like it's something you've been waiting for, you know. It's where that your ships are finally coming in, but it's too late for this person. Well, they're going to tuck tail and run. I can see them. This is someone who's not really ready for a relationship anyway, but they get jealous if there's competition. Yeah, see, they get jealous if there's competition. They don't want you to uh, meet anyone else, get out there. But you are anyway, by the looks of it. Yeah, see, you're playing it safe, being cautious. See, this is someone who wasn't really giving you something you wanted anyway. So that's why I feel like you're just playing it safe. Um, just kind of waiting. I feel like you were open to this person probably at some point. Uh, but I don't think you're going to get what you want. This is someone who just wants, you know, they want what they want. They want you to indulge them. But you've got another person. So let's focus on this new person. Oh, you've got an emperor. Wow, someone who really knows what they want. <laughs> a little Taurus or Aries energy, Leo, someone new. Could be an Aries, very powerful, that's stronger than the Leo energy. So I say one of these people could be a, a Leo, somebody could be an Aries, maybe Sagittarius. <laughs> well, you have an emperor, someone new. Oh, yeah, see, you kept your options open while you were waiting for somebody. <laughs> 
Oh yeah, look at that. You can see the possibilities with this person. They're fantasizing here, um, I feel. But I feel like you've manifested this because you just kind of waited. You see, you went out while you were waiting. You were focused on money, staying balanced. I feel you, gr you were grounded in being sensible. Uh, I feel like you went out and met somebody else or you went someplace and you're going to get something you want. Put it that way. Someone's about to give you what you want too. So looks like you've been kind of just doing your own thing while you were manifesting and likely manifesting some money and love. So, wow. Tell me about the magician. Oh yeah, you got opportunities coming in. Something solid, something reliable. It's the start of something. It's about building a foundation. So some of you may be, you know, while you're waiting, maybe you got a new job, bought a new home. Who knows what's going on? It's very positive for you. I feel like you've stayed in that high vibrational positive energy. But you've got something new here. And I feel like it's going to make you really happy. Someone is seeing you as the queen of pentacles, marriage material, everything they could hope for, you see. And you're about to get something that you've been hoping for. Uh, lovely, yeah. So it's an energy of being confident. So you've got someone who's very confident, uh, very strong, very capable. I feel like you've been strong too. Uh, someone sees your strengths, you see. You love yourself first. You know your worth. I feel it's an energy also where you, you, you deserve more. Uh, and that's what I feel like you're going to figure out because you're going to look at the details and the facts of a situation while you're waiting. Sometimes waiting is good, you know, when you just kind of pull back, okay, well, whatever, I'm just going to do me and do what I need to do. And next thing you know it, you kind of change how you feel. I see a lot of growth. I see change coming in here. <laughs> Feeling on top of the world, you know, the abundance is going to start to flow because you're manifesting. Wow. Yeah, and if you if someone sees you in that energy and all of a sudden they come in out of the blue, they're suddenly interested in you and they're in a rush to commit or uh, they want to come to your house or whatever the situation here, I I, I feel like you already kind of know who one of these people are. Want, somebody is definitely coming back around, you see. But you've changed how you conduct yourself. You've kind of become probably, a, by the looks of it, a little bit more patient and um, keeping yourself busy with other things. I see you being busy, okay? I also see that been there, done that, because you have other opportunities. That's why this person, they probably know too. Yeah, well, obviously, maybe even, even when they started coming back around. So there's the energy of control, taking your power back. See, this is someone who lost control. Uh, I feel like you have a person coming towards you who is determined to have success with you. Okay, but I feel like it's yourself, sheer determination, taking your power back, uh, lovely energy. I, I, I think this other person, you know, what I see with them is, is they're, they're looking at you fantasizing, look at all the possibilities, they're about to make a decision. It's possible they have a couple of people, who knows, right? There could be competition, but it's really what this person, they're seeing your strengths. They're seeing you as someone strong, who's confident, okay? You take control of a situation and you can you take control of things because you need to, see? Uh, and I really like this energy. Uh, there's a lot of strength here. This person's pretty confident uh, in their choice here. So they're looking at this, kind of fantasizing. Yeah, they want things to go in their favor. I see a cycle ending. Um, because you're moving away from this person. This other person's kind of coming in quick too. Multiple opportunities are swooping in to take control. It's like they're going to uh, pull you away from this other energy. Competition. Ooh. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is someone who wants, they're determined this will go to the next level. <laughs> so you've got a choice. So this is up to you. You're. I feel like you're going to move away uh, from this person. Because I feel while you're waiting, you went through some kind of change here. Um, definitely uh, loving yourself first, letting go of things or a situation, uh, people, um, this person uh, that no longer serves, right? They're not on your same level. So you've got somebody here who's on your level. This person's not on your level. They're immature, you know, yeah, they love attention. Oh, they love to come in for action. They maybe even be a lot of fun, but they're not on your level. So things are shifting in your favor. You have a whole new cycle beginning. So I feel this is someone who feels confident, 
Okay, this is something uh, very positive. They see the abundance flowing. They see everything that you have to offer. Uh, they see you as someone who's always prepared, uh, always kind of ready. <laughs> if you aren't, it's giving out. Yeah, see, ready, see? Beautiful energy, letting go of something here. Um, you may have had a situation with someone that was on and off. You're likely just getting off that roller coaster, but this is the energy of the abundance flowing. Uh, I see it has to do with your wish fulfillment. Someone sees you as everything they could hope for. I feel it's mutual too, uh, I think, with this person. It's very high vibrational, something that makes you happy. Um, yeah, but if, if it is this other person leveling up, I still feel it's not quite right because you have an emperor, Okay. And that is, for some of you, it could be all one person, okay? Because I know a lot of times I read comments and everyone's pretty much the same energy, but just a little different. Uh, this could be somebody coming in to fight for what they want because they're crazy about you. They don't want you to go out and meet someone new. They could be having to level up very quickly. It's sort of like growing up quick, right? But honestly, I feel for most of you, it's someone who's just not on your level. You're off on a path with this other person who's swooping in. See, you got someone who's a... Little Aries energy, taking a leap of faith, leaving something behind. <laughs> yeah, it's very spontaneous, fast-moving energy here. So you're, this is to do with your hopes and dreams, you and another person. I feel you're going to adore each other. There's a lot of it. This, this is someone who probably admires you, you know, or you admire them. Now, I see the star, two people who are very well-known, possibly. This person could be somebody famous vice versa or just two people who are very popular so you're going to connect um with two people i feel like you you're going to be admiring each other a lot they're admiring you for your strength okay um beautiful something really strong and confident about you but i feel like it goes both ways <laughs> yeah you're both going to get something you want here so some wish fulfillment, see, by letting go of the past. So maybe both of you have got some similar energy, letting go of all the competition, uh, just leaving it all behind, letting go of certain situations, people, whatever, even friends or family for some of you, you know. Yeah, but it looks as though you're just going to meet this new energy. I don't know, you're going out, getting yourself out there maybe more. But I feel this energy of this person taking that leap of faith. They're just going for it. They're coming in. They're determined that this is going to go somewhere. <laughs> They're also determined it goes in their favor. But you are going to get what you want, okay? Well, I'm just going to pull out a couple cards. Sorry for the dog. Shush, babes. Suddenly she's demanding. There we go. See, it's about spreading your wings, being open to each other, you see. You're going to go down a path. There's two of you. Both of you are sharing a similar energy. I love this. You've manifested these opportunities. See, you have all the tools, the information, everything you need. You're ready. You've, you're mastering life here. You're ready for this. This person is ready for you. <laughs> wow. You might even mirror each other a little with this energy. So a couple people. Yeah, similar energies. Lovely. One more of the outcome. Oops, there we go. Ah, challenging times. Yeah, it's an energy of some challenges, obstacles. See, taking action. Over, two people coming together, overcoming obstacles. So there's a, definitely an energy of both of you have overcome some obstacles and challenges. You've got some things in common here. That's what you're going to be talking about and communicating see overcoming both of you now it's either you're going to do something together the challenging times come together okay but i see that energy here twice both of you that's why i feel it's almost like you both are um, letting go of other people situations manifesting they've likely got a couple people they're let, letting go of another person or they're overcoming you know um an unhealthy or a, a relationship with a lot of fighting or but i feel it's more like these uh, this energy of conflict and competition someone's jealous you see um, someone's going to come in and take action and fight for what they want but you've got this other person who's going to run away from this uh, why because this person's very powerful <laughs> the emperor <laughs> oh yes that emperor is going to get what they want <laughs> you're going to give it to them so yeah so there's a lot of obstacles and challenges this is where you both look out for each other you nurture each other you're both going to give each other what you both need you've overcome a lot of things so these are some things you may have in common okay but it's the two of you are going to come together you're open to this 
Oh, lovely. Just spreading your wings, you know. There's that, la that leap of faith. One more. Yeah, see, win or lose, you're both going to go for this. You're going to just let go of the outcome, I feel, and just kind of go with it. I feel like whoever this is, it's coming around here, you know. And, and I feel this is someone who's probably their own worst enemy, you know. They keep coming back around, but I feel as though you've been, you know, and I feel like with your intuition, being really wise about this, okay, you're manifesting marriage, a commitment, Okay, uh, this is somebody I feel who's suddenly coming back around and is now in a hurry because of the competition and they may want to commit. So it is possible some of you are moving away from somebody who acts like they're single when they're not, but it really looks like that person who's in a big hurry to all of a sudden commit because you have another person. Uh, there's now there's competition so win or lose i feel like with that five the two of you can overcome anything here I, i'm seeing this actually being quite successful okay yeah lovely see coming together this is the two people you're going to come together and overcome a lot of things or you've overcome a lot and this is what you have in common that's going to bring you together i love this so take care you guys really deserve all this hard work i see you being really sensible gemini i see this person really seeing you as um somebody you know they can be comfortable with and just be themselves with and talk to you have a common energy you're both very creative i feel okay you're going to create new together that's what i like you're going to build upon your energies so take care and we'll see you soon